Hi, Aaron. My name is Mason. I live in Eugene, Oregon. The tricks I know how to do are the pop shove, kick flip, frontside 180, heel flip, backside flip, and I'm trying to get my tray flips now, but I can't, so that's why I need your support. Thanks. Awesome. So thanks a lot for sending in your video and for your support. Cool. So your pop shove it was pretty much amazing. Definitely better than mine. Frontside 180 was good. Kick flip good. Backside flip pretty good. Heel flip sick. Obviously there's not a lot of room on your porch so yeah that definitely does not help you out very much. And your tray flips su super well rotated. Good job on that. So the board flips right around. Your front foot lands too far forward and your back foot too far back. So let's check this out. Foot position looks okay. Back foot scoop super hard. And then fully rotated and then put your front foot on there. Interesting. So it was it's pretty interesting for me that you got your backside flips down, but you didn't do a varial flip. You may or may not have your varial flips down. I don't know, but at least you didn't show it. But if you don't have them down, I highly, highly recommend getting your varial flips down. It will help you out a lot just in terms of what to do with your front foot, how to flick it, and how to catch it with your front foot because it is very similar to the tray flip. And obviously it's a little bit easier when you're first starting because you don't have to do the full 360 rotation. Cool, so with that said, there's a few things I'm gonna say to help you out. Your back foot is kicking off way back into the back. You're actually just stepping off with your back foot which is totally fine as a practice step, but obviously once you're done with that practice step and you have it fully rotated good enough and fast enough, then you're gonna have to bring that back foot forward, actually jump and fully commit on that tray flip because right now you're, you're kind of kicking your board forward. So with that said, I also thought it was very interesting that you're kicking your board forward, but also you're jumping forward a lot. So there's this strange thing that occurs with tray flips. If you're not like leaning in the back seat as you pop them, you, your body goes really far forward and your board goes back behind you. And that is occurring to you at the same time as trying to bring your back foot back. And that's why you land with your feet spread so far apart. So you wanna, you wanna handle that by before you pop the trick, you want to be a little bit leaning back into the back seat with a little more weight onto your back foot. So then when you pop it and scoop it, you're shoving the board more forward, more in front of you. That way, your front foot is going to land towards more towards the middle slash front truck area of the board, like right there. That's right where you want to land it. You want to land bolts. You want your front foot to catch it on the front of the board and then your back foot to land and you got it. So yeah, just continue practicing those steps. Um, just continue practicing that scoop super hard, leaving that front foot out there to catch the board. And then after you've got that really, really down, pull that back foot forward and stomp it. So for any of you guys wanting to master skateboarding, get Skateboarding Made Simple. Your time is now, let's learn to skate.